Hey everyone, Dan from On One here. You've seen a couple improvements to the healing brush, and I've got at least one more trick up my sleeve to show you guys here. So I figured I'd show you all these new modes on one photo. Let's start out with the classic healing mode. In this case, I want to use it to remove this little bit of lens flare at the bottom. I'm just going to simply paint over a region that I don't want, and it'll make a copy, and I can choose where that copy comes from and how it blends in. I just align it in what I think looks the most natural way. And that's the way you're going to use the healing brush quite often. But I also showed you the new copy option as well. So if I come up here and I select copy, let's say I want to add a couple more leaves. I'm just going to copy this little patch of two leaves right here. I'm going to drag it over here. And I can show you the new transform options by holding down the alt key on Windows or the option key on the Mac that allows me to scale, rotate, and flip those patches. So I'm just going to flip it left to right. So it doesn't look quite so obvious and I'm just going to scale it a little bit bigger so they don't look quite as obvious that I'm stealing those guys. There we go. And here's the new one, the new trick up the sleeve. That is the move option. With move, you can actually paint over an element and move it to another spot in the photo. So let's say now this leaf right here is too close to the other ones. I want to move it over to the left a little bit. Now I simply just paint over what I want to move and I can move it. Now it becomes a new patch that I can choose where I want to position it and you notice it fills the source the place that it came from with where I'm putting it in at so you're just kind of exchanging positions with one spot to another and of course these are all non-destructive so you can go back and edit them you can change their feather their position delete or move them at any time just like that there's before the retouching and after just like that there you go. There's kind of a recap of the new modes of the healing brush. You now have the ability to transform and scale and flip the region. You can copy and you can move now. There you go. Thanks for watching.